with luscious chocolates, luxury watches and cities bursting with beauty. Switzerland is a country that is hard to beat. Although tourists come here to see the jaw-dropping scenery, they also are charmed by its culture and history. Switzerland is said to be the most beautiful country in the world. So let's find out in today's video, what are the 10 most beautiful places to visit in Switzerland itself? Number 10. The Rhine Falls Known as the most powerful waterfall of Europe, Rhine Falls is located near the town of Schaffhausen and is an elegant place to witness. With a height of 23 meters and width of 150 meters, it is one of the largest waterfalls in Europe. The thing that's really incredible is the huge volume of water flowing through it. 600 meter cube of water flows per second in the summers. If you're feeling a little extra adventurous, you can rent a boat and get up close with the falls or explore nearby castles while still in the water. You can even visit the beautiful treetops in the Rhine Falls National Park. There are numerous cafes in this place that overlook the falls. Here you can just relax and decompress with a beverage. It's a good idea to visit Rhine Falls on Switzerland's National Day as it hosts a colorful and vibrant fireworks show on this day. Number 9. Bern. Bern is the capital of Switzerland and a city rich in culture. To see the true essence of Bern, you should first visit its old town. The town is situated on a cliff and surrounded by the beautiful river Aare. These features have earned this place the title of a UNESCO World Heritage Site. Kunstmuseum is a massive art museum that contains more than 50,000 works of art, including paintings, drawings, photographs, sculptures, and much more. Built 1879, Kunstmuseum is the oldest art museum of Switzerland and is worth a visit even if you're not an art lover. Zitlogel Clock Tower is the most renowned landmark of the city and is regularly visited by tourists. This 800-year-old clock tower even puts on a little show of mechanical creatures just three minutes before each hour. Tourists are also welcomed to climb this building or visit its interior. There are year-round celebrations and festivals in Bern, each having its specific and creative features. Number 8. The Matterhorn Matterhorn is a giant pyramid-shaped mountain in the Alps, and it is one of the most photographed mountains in the world. With a height of 4,478 meters, Matterhorn challenges mountaineers from around the world to summit it. But if you're not feeling so energetic, you can just use a cable car, as this place has the highest cable car station in the entire Alps. Matterhorn's Theodol Glacier is open for skiing throughout the year, so make sure you don't miss the thrilling skiing experience. The skiing resort also has a museum dedicated to the mountain. Matterhorn is probably one of the most visited places in Switzerland, and once you visit it, you will see the spellbinding effect it has on people. Number 7. The Swiss National Park In a country filled beautiful natural sceneries, it can be hard to decide what places to visit. But the Swiss National Park is without a doubt a place you wouldn't want to miss. This is the country's only national park and it gives you an idea of how the European Alps were before all the tourism. The park has many hiking trails that will take you past unimaginable heights and sights of glaciers and captivating meadows. If you are lucky, you might also get to see the exotic animals that know this park as their home, like the red deer, ibexes, red squirrels, and much more. Also, keep an eye out for the golden eagles that roam the skies of this national park. There is also a museum in this place that tells the story of the extinct bears that once lived in this park. Number 6. Lucerne Lucerne is situated at the northern end of Lake Lucerne. This city has successfully preserved its medieval cultures 
and elegantly ancient buildings. Lucerne provides an amiable environment for its tourists, so they freely roam in the streets. The Chapel Bridge is arguably the most popular attraction of the city. It's a diagonal bridge running over the River Rius. It's an immensely photograph-friendly place, so don't forget to take a picture or two for your Instagram. Rent a boat and relax in it as it floats over the beautiful Lake Lucerne. The number of historic structures and monuments in this place are beyond counting. Jesuit Church, Hofkirche, and Lohenden Kma are just a few of the graceful monuments in this city. Number 5. Zurich Zurich is the largest city of Switzerland and the economic center of the country. It's one of the leading financial cities of the world, so its delightful aspect as a tourist destination is sometimes foreshadowed by its economic importance. In the midst of this urban city is the Niederdorf neighborhood. It's a medieval street that preserves the ancient culture of Zurich. This area is filled with cool, and aesthetic cafes and restaurants. If you want to get a really good view of this magnificent city, visit Ethelberg. It's only a 10-minute walk from the bottom to the summit. Once you're at the top, you can gaze at the city below and just take it all in. Now that you've seen the breathtaking view of Zurich, visit the Zurich Zoo, as it's one of the finest zoos in all Europe. Or if you don't feel like it, just spend a day near the soothing Zurich Lake. Zurich will never fail to amaze you as a tourist spot. Number 4. Lugano This city is located on the lake side of Lake Lugano in the southern region of Switzerland. This is an Italian-speaking region of the country and you'll find a mixture of both Italian and Swiss culture in this area. Lugano is famous for its exquisite meridian scenery and Lake Lugano itself. The city is known as the Monte Carlo of Switzerland due to its popularity as a vacation destination among celebrities. If you want an escape from the city of Lugano, Civico Siani, it's a park and is the best place to go. Located near the Lugano Lake, this garden has a variety of beautiful and rare plants that will set your mood right. If you want to see a glimpse of the past, visit the elegant San Lorenzo Cathedral and just admire its simplicity and beauty. Number 3. Interlaken Interlaken is a popular summer holiday resort of Switzerland, situated between Lake Brienz to the east and Lake Thun to the west. It's a picturesque place that is totally worth a visit. The center of the town is an urban engineering marvel, and it's filled with beautiful gardens, cafes, and hotels. There are numerous modes of transportation like railways, chairlifts, cable cars, and ski lifts that take tourists into the surrounding countryside and provides plenty of chances to gaze at this wonderful resort from up above. Although this place is mostly preferred in summers by its visitors, it's surrounded by skiing resorts that attract the more energetic and adventurous tourists in the winter. Number 2. Chateau de Chillon The reason we have included Chateau de Chillon on the list is not merely due to its gracefulness as a building, but also due to the literacy importance that it holds. This lakeside castle has inspired famous writers for centuries. Jean-Jacques Rousseau, Lord Byron, and Victor Hugo are some of the greatest writers in history that have written about Chateau de Chillon. This castle was the stronghold of many counts and dukes from the 12th century and comprises 25 buildings clustered together. The building gives a dark and gloomy vibe, yet you will somehow feel inspired by this historic monument that tells a Parnassian story of Switzerland. Number 1. Geneva The most famous and rich city of Switzerland, Geneva holds the authentic Swiss identity. The city is known for its modernization, natural scenic beauty, and monuments. Lake Geneva alone is enough to make your trip worth it to this unique city. 
It's like there's a place worth visiting around every corner of the city. The Geneva Water Fountain is one of the most famous attractions of this place. Or if you want to visit a place that's a little more unique, you can visit the Patek Philippe Watch Museum, owned by the famous watch manufacturer company Patek Philippe, and see why Swiss take so much pride in their watches. The nightlife of Geneva is filled with clubs, bars, and concerts. Geneva for sure knows how to party. There's so much more to this beautiful country that makes it one of the greatest European nations. Let us know in the comments which one of these 10 places you found the most interesting. Leave a like on this video and subscribe to our channel. If you haven't done that yet, stay tuned for the next video. Until then, take care.